Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, we're going to be ranking my top 10 favorite skins in Fortnite. Um, this has been a video that I've been wanting to do for quite a while now, and I think now's the time to do it. Um, as a lot of skins have just come out, and they kind of make my top 10 um, that way. So if you do enjoy this type of video, make sure to subscribe and like the video, and comment uh, your top 10 or your favorite skin from my top 10, and tell me what you think about it. So without any further ado, let us begin with the video. So before being the top 10, we have a couple honorable mentions. The first honorable mention, out of six honorable mentions, uh, I'm going to put these two together. It's Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy. Uh, these skins are absolutely fantastic, and I think about a month ago, they both would have made my top 10. But since then, skins have come out, and I think... They're quite better. I still think that these are the two best DC skins, and I do believe that um, I do believe that they're worth a mention. But even though these skins are ranked here, don't think I don't like them. I think these skins are absolutely fantastic. Uh, I do love all their styles. Uh, the Harley Quinn ones actually feel like really different because uh, they because they look really really because they look really different. Ones from Birds of Prey, ones from Suicide Squad. Um, even though they don't make the top 10, I do think that, um, I do think that they're really fantastic and they could take me. The next honorable mention is going to go to Storm. I do think this is a great Marvel skin. I'm trying to put all the collaboration skins in the honorable mentions, not to flood up my top 10, but I do think that Storm is a really good skin and worth a mention. She's also, um, a fantastic Marvel skin. Um, I didn't really expect her to come into Fortnite. I kind of expected stuff like Spider-Man and stuff like that. I really didn't expect to have a Storm skin in Fortnite. But, um, I'm really glad we have her. I think, uh, everything's really, really good about her. Nothing wrong to say. The next honorable mention is going to go to Drift. Great skin. Nothing bad about it, I think. Uh, it's a really good skin. Uh, my, was my main a couple of years back. I think it's re really, really good. Really, really good skin. That being said, despite not it being in the top 10, I'm really happy that we got it because then we got other skins like the Drift form for Singularity, Catalyst. Um, not really happy about Fade, but I mean, uh, cool concept, Dark Drift, really cool. Um, I'm really thankful that we got this skin. We have two last honorable mentions. Then the last, second last honorable mention is going to go to Stoneheart. Really, I really like this skin. The hair is amazing. Um, and honestly, a really good take on Love Ranger, which is a, also a good skin. But I do think that this one is miles better. And finally, the last honorable mention is going to go to Lachlan, the latest Icon series skin. Really, really good. I'm really proud of this one. I think the skin's fantastic, and the content creator is also really good. Um... Honestly, nothing bad, and also the reactive style is absolutely fantastic, is what gives it the honorable mention status, in my opinion. So entering the top 10, our first skin in the top 10 is going to be the Dark Wild Card. Um, it can really go to any of the suit skins, I just really like Dark Wild Card the most. I think, um, he, I, I think Dark Wild Card is the best dark skin, and I do think that the dark really suits him really well. Really, you can put any of the dark... Uh, any of the wild card skins like Inferno or a Double Agent wild card or anything, I just think that the Dark Wild Card um, suits suits the theme the best, and uh, that's why it gets the number ten position. And the number nine position is gonna go to surprisingly a skin from the last laugh bundle is gonna go to Midas Rex. I didn't like the skin when it was first revealed back in August, but I used it, and I think it is one of the most fantastic and outstanding skins ever. I didn't think he'd be better than Midas, but honestly, uh, he's really good, and um, I'm honestly really, really happy that we have this skin in the game, and uh, I can't wait for them to do other takes on Midas, hopefully. The number 8 spot is going to go to my girl, Loserfruit. Uh, best icon series skin. Um, honestly, um, I have nothing bad to say about this skin. Uh, Loser Fruit is honestly um, a really good icon series skin. Uh, her animated feature is amazing. You can combo her up with so many things, and 
the person itself herself is just really really nice and i love to watch loser fruit on her streams and everything um she's just really entertaining and i'm super happy that she got her own skin really much deserved number seven spot is going to go to the female version of the skin we just saw a couple minutes ago it's going to be catalyst the female drift now my 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 uh my opinion really changes on Drift and Callus, which one's better, which one's worse. I both I think that they're both absolutely fantastic skins. I just think Catalyst, because of her color variants, make make her better. Yes, she has less progression, but I do believe that the colors really make her worth um the number seven spot. She used to be number two, but so many skins have surpassed her since then. I think um I think she's honestly really good, and um, I'm so happy to own her. The number six spot is going to go to um, the for the first Fortnite crew bundle skin is going to be Galaxia. Uh, this is a much improved version of um, of Galaxy Scout. I think Galaxy Scout is great, and Astra are both great, but I think that this one is just amazing. It's just a mixture of Bright Bomber and Galaxy, and it's just absolutely perfect. And um, Galaxia is just a really unique skin. I love the Galaxy, and uh, I really love everything about her. Like, the only thing that I don't like about this skin is the secondary style. The first style, so redeeming, perfect for number six. If she had a better alternative style, she would have been much higher on the list. I just don't like it. She looks like a dork. That's really mean, but she looks like a dork. The first style, fantastic. I love Bright Bomber. I love Galaxy skins. And just perfect. But the second style is just, I, I, can't, I don't like it. The number five spot is going to be the highest ranked tier one skin. Not the highest ranked battle pass skin. It is going to go to Calamity. Uh, this has always been a skin that I love, a skin that I always ran. I stopped running her near the beginning of Chapter 2, but I started using her again. I think uh, Calamity's progression is really good. Her color styles are fantastic. I think her middle version is better than all her other versions. I know it doesn't make sense, but um, I think that the I think that all her styles are amazing. Um, and yeah. The number four spot is going to go to the only exclusive skin on this list is going to be the Wildcat skin released uh, about a month and a half ago. I didn't think I would like this skin so much. Um, I got her about a couple weeks ago, and I think that um, she she's amazing. Um, her her three styles are absolutely unique. Uh, the last one being my favorite, but all being amazingly good. Um, I don't really know what it is about this skin. I think it's the beanie that makes it for me. I do like some some beanies. I like also um also just the aesthetic and the thing that she's like um the first exclusive switch skin in a while. That doesn't really affect my choice, but I think that she she she's worth her exclusivity rank and even if she came in the shop, I'd still like her this much. The number 3 the number 3 spot is going to go to the skin you've been watching gameplay of since the beginning of the video, uh, bundles. I I have no idea what it is about this skin. See, Wildcat, it was about the beanie, the colors, really nice, really good. I have no idea what it is about this skin. I just, I really like it. The, um, the bear skins are not always my favorites. I think they're pretty good, uh, uh, but I have no idea what it is. This one, Cuddle Team Leader. And cuddle pool. All three of them. I have no idea what it is, but I love them a lot. Um, I think that bundles is the best. It's also the best Christmas skin. I I just don't know what it is about this skin that I love so much. It's um, maybe the backling Gwynny because that's the, probably the most adorable backling in the game. But I have honestly no idea why I love this skin so much. Um, it's it's really nice. Um, I consider you pick it up next time it hits the shop because I think it just left. But yeah, you pick it up. It's really, really good in my opinion. The number two spot is going to go to the highest ranked shop skin in um in this list it is going to be Hemlock. Uh, this is the also my favorite Halloween skin. 
Uh, I really like this skin. It's, um, I like the colors. I like, uh, that she's, like, the first skin that could, like, um, that could change styles in-game. That was really revolutionary in the time. Now, like, you see a little more with skin, um, with skins. Actually, I don't remember which skin, um, there are loads of skins that can change their style in-game now. Uh, but this was, like, the first one. This was the first one that started the trend, and, um... The fact that Hemlock was the first, and especially, like, she's an absolutely amazing skin. Um, I just really like her. Also, like, uh, the witch feel to it. She, um, she, she was, like, the one skin that I was waiting for since Halloween of last year. And I, I think you should pick her up next time she comes to the shop if you don't have her. She's honestly really worth it. She also comes with two amazing styles and a decent back bling that goes with a little bit. But, um... Yeah, definitely a really good skin. And finally, coming in at the number one spot. Um, it's not really a surprise that it's going to be Sky. Um, I don't know. It's just the moment I saw the skin in the Season 2 Battle Pass trailer, I knew that that was the one that would be my favorite skin. Sure, I have done a little bit of hesitations with uh, Hemlock, for example, I thought Hemlock was my favorite skin after Sky was released because I got Hemlock after I got Sky. No, Sky is the one. <laughs> I think her gold style is absolutely amazing. Although I chose Shadow, I'm not really mad because um, I like all her styles. I think all of them are really unique and all of them, all of them uh, give it give off the same personality vibe. I also relate to Sky a lot as like she kind of resembles my personality as someone that's really childish and everything. Um, um, also the also the fact also the fact that like um that like I could keep looking forward to getting the ghost style even though I'm probably never gonna get it. Um, I'm. But, uh, yeah, I personally chose Shadow, as I said before. I wish I chose Ghost, but I'm honestly not really mad because all of her styles are great. Um, I'm really happy with this skin, and I'm so glad it's in the game. Literally, the only the only skin that, that could surpass it is, it. is uh, a remade version or, um, or a Ray K. Bros. Icon series skin, which will never happen. Thank you guys for making it to the end of the video. I really appreciate it. This video has taken me quite a long time to make. Um, thank you guys for watching the video. Uh, let me know what were your thoughts on this. Um, and should I make this type of video again? I had fun making it. Uh, sure, time is length. It took a really long time to make. But, I mean, I'm happy. If it's, if it makes you guys happy, then I'm happy. And, uh, let me know what you guys want to see on the channel. I'm really open for opinions. Um, if you wanna, if you wanna get to know me a little better, be sure to follow me on Twitter. If you want a Discord server link, I'm gonna up upgrade my discord server soon this week um i'm gonna make it better and much better place to hang out and um i'll see you guys later um have a nice day